engineer 775 I know I've shown you a thousand of these wells but this is not your normal well this is a well that is a very low producer uh, the well driller said it's uh, producing about 30 gallons an hour or a half a gallon a minute Let's see we've got a pitless adapter set up so you know a lot of companies would say that this well is not any good and that you spend eight thousand dollars on nothing well we've uh, rescued a lot of wells like this using solar water pumping low water sensors and then using a tank so what I just measured in this well there's a static water level about 80 wells over 400 feet deep that's a lot of storage so that'll recover every day and we can pump that water so for every foot of that casing you've got a gallon and a half of water and uh, and so what we do is we pump at a low rate we're going to use one solar panel to pump the water out of the well to a elevated cistern and uh, you see that the ditches are done here's the pump that was very bright I hope this comes out and then we've laid out our wires and our safety ropes and our poly for 225 feet or so and again the as this pump pumps the water down in the well to a certain spot we're gonna put a low water sensor and once it hits that it'll stop pumping and that sensor is tied to a timer and then the timer can be adjusted and so it'll hit the timing circuit and it'll let the well recover at its rate half a gallon a minute for a period of time and then it'll turn the pump back on so the pumps not cycling on and off on and off so we can easily we feel in this situation easily get 300 gallons a day out of this well stored so if you have enough storage capacity you can get way ahead of the game there's un, just a great solar location here where you have plenty of sun so that's not going to be an issue and then we'll uh, we're going to just use one 285 watt module to pump the water the other module will be for charging some batteries for a booster pump and this will all be connected to a shop in a, in a house so do you have a little producer you know a friend that spent a lot of money on a well and I've known several that have spent upwards of fifteen thousand dollars on their well and they've got no water so that's pretty depressing to me so we have solutions and it's just uh, using a series of float switches and tank storage and and then sizing it the pump appropriately and the amount of solar so that you have a, a pump that will last a very long time without cycling a lot and it'll pump whatever the well will produce so um, and plus we're putting a hand pump in so there's no reason you can't put a hand pump in in a well like this it still makes water there's still a ton of water in that well we're just going to get it out of there in an effective way